Good afternoon now. I never uh, spoke to you guys. My hair is going crazy again. All these wisps. It is noonish and as our day off, you know, Mondays are our Saturday since Jake's has Monday and Tuesdays off. Usually we have packed orders, labeled and skeined some yarn, and we are about to head over to the post office to drop off the packages, Nitty City to drop off, nope, wrong one, Knit New Haven to drop off some more packages, and then Westport Yarns to drop off a wholesale order, which we have back here, and then run some errands. So, you know, just a really late day off, morning, weekends spent working. So that's my life. I love it. I don't know what else that I would do if I wasn't working all the time. So we are gonna go do some errands. We are packed and ready to go. Maybe we'll get Luna clean. She needs a good vacuuming after New England. 
Stop one, done. We dropped off packages at the post office, and now we are off to New Haven. It's my favorite yarn store, I think. I don't know why I thought I could get a 95 without hitting traffic. But here I am, stuck in traffic. On noon. At noon, on a Monday. For no reason. There's nothing. There's nothing happening. For miles. Just nobody driving. It's great. This is why I don't leave my house. The downside of Connecticut is we don't have a great public transport transport uh, situation. So you kind of need a car, and you need to sit in traffic apparently. Now I'm hungry, and I'm in the middle of nowhere. All right. Stop two is complete. We went to New Haven, but the parking was awful, so we could not stay like we were hoping. And I was hoping I could maybe stop somewhere and get lunch in New Haven. But again, there's no parking. I'm at a stoplight right now. I'm really hungry. There's a great place next to them. Uh, it smelled so good while I ran by. So we are now off to I think Westport on the clear other side of the state not really it's only like a probably 30 minute drive from here um, and then we had to go to Trader Joe's and stop at a pet store and get some cat food Trader Joe's has cat food maybe we don't have to stop oh, damn, so this is my errand running takes me all over the place and all these Yale students are walking so slow. I don't know why I thought Trader Joe's would not be busy at one on a Monday. And it's packed. This is why I don't leave the house. Every time. This just reminds me. So we decided to skip Westport. We're going to go tomorrow and run some more errands down in Fairfield County because I don't feel like driving down there. And we have to go down there tomorrow for knitting. But the amount of traffic between Westport and Fairfield is about the same as if I just drove down there right now. So we're just gonna do it tomorrow, which is super dumb because that rush hour traffic is so dumb. So we're just gonna super back road it to knitting and leave really early, get dinner at Panera tomorrow. So let's go to Trader Joe's, ooh, pull through, and try not to spend all of our money on snacks. Do, 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 bam, ha <laughs> All right. Dangerous, I'm sorry.
Just trying to edit this. <laughs>